Today, Narimanov District Court continued the trial of five people arrested during the protest against the hijab ban that took place on May 6 in front of the Education Minister. Judge Rasim Kazimov presided over the hearing. Of the protesters, Alban Hussein of Rosha Mamadov, Nurani Mamadov, Araz Ismailov, and Rufat Miliyev are being charged under Article 221.3 of the Criminal Court, hooliganism with the use of weapons and items used as a weapon. As usual, no filming or photography was allowed in the trial. Journalists were not allowed into the courtroom. The protesters' lawyer, Anar Gassanlu, told Objective TV that in today's hearing they had a response to the motion filed during the last trial, asking who exactly was alleged to have injured the victims and how many victims were included in this case. The prosecutor responded that there are five victims. Consequently, the lawyer immediately filed a motion demanding that the court remove the other 30 alleged victims who have been included in the indictment which claims 35 victims. However, the judge denied the motion. Then the defendants gave testimony. The majority of them pled partially guilty. They said that during the protest against hijab ban, the police attacked them without warning. They threw stalled in self-defense. Then came testimonies from seven victims, all of whom are police employees, saying that they did not recognize the defendants. They did not pursue complaints against them. The proceedings will continue on September 13. On May 6, approximately 150 Muslims attempt to hold a protest in front of the education minister. Faced with assault from the police, the protesters began to throw stones at them. According to law enforcement agencies, the protesters damaged four automobiles and several shops and trade centers. 26 police officers were injured. 45 people were detained and 25 were required to pay damages.